hi everyone welcome back to my channel in today's video i'm gonna recreate this uh, look worn by deepika parukone to the cans uh, film festival in which she had uh, this super bold was print eyeliner so let's get started First, I'm gonna fill in my eyebrows using the NYX Auto Eyebrow Pencil in the shade Dark Brown which is like a warm brown color. Uh, Deepika also had a very warm brown uh, eyebrow going on so I'm gonna do the same. Next, I'm gonna take the LA Girl Pro Concealer in the shade Fawn and I'm gonna clean up around my eyebrows and use this concealer as an eyelid um, base. To blend the concealer, I'm using the PAC uh, 212 uh, Concealer Blending Brush. Moving on to the face, I'm going to take the NYX Angel Veil Primer and I'm going to dot it on my face and rub it into my skin using my fingertips. Next, I'm gonna conceal any discolorations uh, on my face such as the dark circles, the acne spots and the pigmentation around my mouth area using the same LA Girl Concealer. And then I'm gonna use the same pack um, concealer blending brush to blend out all of the concealer. For foundation, I'm going to mix these two shades uh, from the L'Oreal True Match foundation range and one is called Golden Cappuccino and the other one is called Nut Brown. So I've mixed the both foundations together to custom create my uh, color. So I'm just going to dot that on my entire face. I love this foundation. This is super skin like and super easy to blend and it gives a very skin like finish. So I'm just blending it out using the pack uh, buffing brush, I think the number is called 231. Uh, now to highlight my face, I'm going to use the uh, L'Oreal True Match Concealer in the shade N6 to 7 which is like 2 to 3 shades um, lighter than my skin tone. So I'm going to apply that underneath my eyes, on the center of my nose, on my cupid's bow and chin. I'm using the same buffing brush to blend everything out. Again this concealer is a very very uh, blendable product. To set everything in place, I'm going to use the Bharat and Doris loose powder in the number 5. So I'm just going to dab the powder uh, using a powder puff which comes along with the powder. And also I'm going to take some extra powder and bake um, under my eyes. I'm going to take a small blending brush and brush out all of the excess powder except the under eye package and the powder around my mouth. Then to add a bit of color to my crease, I'm using a NYX bronzer. Now to uh, coming to the showstopper of the makeup look which was the reverse winged eyeliner. So I'm going to map out the shape for my winged eyeliner. So I'm creating the outer and inner wing first. You want to do it in uh, small short strokes and take your time while doing this. And then I'm going to create that thickness uh, of the wing by creating those short strokes. Slowly and gently, I'm just going to connect it uh, to the outer wing. Mm -hmm. 
Once I've got the shape for both the winged eyeliners, I'm going to brush off all of the excess powder. Next, I'm going to take the Plum Nature Studio Kajal in the shade Black. And first, I'm going to tight line my eyes because Deepika had a nice tight line going on. And then I'm going to fill in the uh, rest of the gap that is shown. Once the filling part is done, I'm going to take a bit of that LA Girl concealer on a small angled brush and clean up under the eyeliner uh, to kind of um, define it a little bit and to erase any mistakes. Then to coat my eyelashes, I'm using the Maybelline Lash Temptation Mascara and I'm only applying the mascara to my top lashes. Now I'm going to add a bit of bronzer to my face. For that I'm using the same NYX uh, matte bronzer in the shade Dark Tan. Deepika did not have any bronzer or contour but my face definitely needs it. So I'm just going to add a light wash of bronzer on my entire face. And also I'm going to shape my nose because Deepika has beautiful slender nose. For blusher I'm going to use the Lottie London Blush Crush Matte. Uh, blusher in the shade Zac which is like a mauve pink shade. Deepika had a very uh, Barbie doll pink blusher going on and the blush application was kind of spread out on her entire cheek area. So I have applied the blush on the apples of my cheeks and also I'm going to take that blusher on top of the contour as well to give that flushed uh, pink effect. And she definitely had very, very subtle highlight for that. I'm using the Makeup Revolution um, Radiant Lights Highlighter in the shade Glow and adding a very tiny amount on my face. For lips, I'm going to use the Kiko Milano uh, Smart Fusion Lip Liner in the shade 531. And I'm going to draw uh, my lips um, and slightly going to overdraw my lips because Deepika has those nice... Uh, plumped lips my lips are very thin and tiny so I'm gonna make them look a little bit fuller for lipstick I'm gonna mix two lipsticks from MAC one is called all fired up which is like a bright pink shade and uh, the other one is called taupe which is like a muted um, nudish brown kind of a color so I'm just dabbing the pink lipstick first because she had a kind of a pink stain on her lips not a, a full opaque color next I'm gonna dab the taupe uh, color on top of the pink uh, lipstick and that is the lip color next I'm gonna take a bit of concealer and clean up around my mouth to give it a crisp uh, and defined look so that is the makeup complete I quickly did my hair in a sleek high ponytail like Deepika And that is the finished uh, Deepika Parukone Scans makeup look. I really hope you guys enjoyed watching this video. If you did, please do give this video a huge thumbs up, comment and do not forget to subscribe to my channel for more such videos. And I shall see you all soon in my next video. Bye!